Do you feel like your aim is off sometimes? Do you whiff a lot of your shots because of your sense? Well, in this video I'm going to try and help you to find your EDPI and your sense to help you improve your environment. But before the video starts, make sure to like and subscribe so I can make more content like this. Now enjoy the tutorial. So the first thing we are going to talk about is EDPI. So what exactly is EDPI? EDPI stands for Effective Dots Per Inch. It's a measure that helps players standardize their mouse sensitivity settings by combining their mouse DPI, dots per inch, and their in-game sensitivity settings. EDPI is calculated by multiplying players' mouse DPI by their in-game sensitivity. The formula is EDPI equals DPI multiplied by in-game sensitivity. For example, if a player uses a mouse with a DPI of 800 and in-game sensitivity of 0.5, their EDPI would be 400. However, many professional players tend to use EDPI values between 200 and 600, with some outliers using higher or lower values. It's important to know that the best EDPI value is highly individual and what works well for one player might not work for another. That's why you should experiment and find an EDPI that feels comfortable and allows for precise aiming and movement in game. Now I'm going to give you a comparison between high and low sense and their pros and cons. So the pros of high sense are quick reflexes, less dead space if you play on small mouse pod, 360 degree movement which is pretty useless in Valorant, and cons of high sense are not much precision, inconsistent aim, recoil control is more tricky and less stable crosshair. On other hand, on low sense the pros are precision, aim, stable crosshair, recoil control, and it helps refine muscle memory. The cons of low sense are slower turns, slower reaction time if you are not used to it. After I told you everything about high sense, low sense and EDPI, I'm going to show you my easy method to find your sense. As I said earlier, professional players tend to use the EDPI between 200 and 600 and the average is 277, 0 0.35 on 800 DPI. So we are going to go to the range and see how we feel with the average sense that pros use. If you feel like the sense is too fast, make sure to lower it and if you feel like it's too slow, you can hire the sense. After you find which sense is the best for you, you can try it in team that much and see if you're doing good with it. Make sure to use that sense for at least two for three weeks and if you are not feeling good with it you can try and change it again last thing that i will talk about in this video is patience you need to play a lot of games on the same sense so you can see if you have precision aim and stable crosshair and if you already have sense that you use for a long time i don't recommend changing it so thank you guys again for watching and i'll see you in my next video see ya